Hello and welcome to Apex Reviews. Today we're going to be visiting Seattle, Washington. We stayed at a hotel called The Moor. It was in downtown and easy walking distance to all of the fun stuff. The hotel rooms were a little basic, but that was part of the charm, or at least that's what my sister told me. Once we arrived, we decided to head over to Biscuit Pitch for a good breakfast. Their biscuits were fantastic. After that, we needed an after breakfast angioplasty. This sandwich right here gave me diabetes, and I may have lost a toe. After breakfast, we headed down to Pike's Place Fish Market. A little touristy, but still a lot of fun. If you want, they'll throw fish at you. This lady caught hers and did a little dance. I chose not to participate in that activity. You can order anything you want, and they'll package it up and ship it to wherever you live. The market's got a lot more than just fish. You can find flowers and all sorts of arts and crafts. After Pike's Market, we took this gum line tunnel down to the Ferris wheel. I tried a few pieces. It wasn't bad. From there, I went and got a tetanus shot, and then we headed over to the Ferris wheel. The views from the Ferris wheel were pretty great. My favorite part, though, were the drinks they sold to you while you waited in line. They weren't half bad. If you're scared of heights, I suggest getting a few. They let you take the drinks with you in the cabin, which made for an enjoyable afternoon. Here you can see the second adventure we were going to have on tap for the day. We took a locks tour on the Argosy. That was a lot of fun also. Again, I can't overstate the fact that they had a full bar inside. The weather was fantastic, so between the drinks and front row seats, it was a really great time. There's a lot to see while on the LOX tour, including this amphibious aircraft taking off and landing here at the seaport. Frazier lives somewhere in those buildings. I'm not sure where. We were gonna go up into the Space Needle, but it was under construction. So we had to postpone that for a different day. Instead, we went up to the top of this skyscraper. They also had a full bar and the views were amazing. This skyscraper is actually taller than the Space Needle. You could even see Mount Rainier. There's a lot to do in Seattle and transportation is really easy. If you ever get the chance, I definitely recommend going. A four day trip would be just the right amount of time. Thanks for watching.